Hi, I'm Tracy Hines, and I'm here to show you how to get a sultry Poison Ivy look for Halloween. Poison Ivy is my favorite DC character, so I'm pretty excited to share this transformation with you. Let's get started. For this look, you will need your Lovesick Eye Kit, your Lovesick Brush Set, Lovesick Smooth Criminal Gel Liner, Lovesick's Black Coal Eyeliner, your Hot Topic 12-piece eyeshadow palette, your Hot Topic eyelash curler, Lovesick Thanks for the Lift Super Mega Mascara, a Black Heart Lip Pencil in Burgundy, Black Heart's Lip Pencil in Vamp Red, and Matte Lip Cream in Bright and Deep Red. I've already prepped my face with full coverage foundation, concealer, and powder. Cover any skin imperfections and begin with a flawless base. The next step is to put on your brows. Using a red pencil like Hot Topic's Black Heart Lip Pencil in Burgundy, define your brow shape. It might seem weird to use a lip liner on your eyebrows, but it's a great hack when you need vibrant red brows. I'm emphasizing the arch in my brows quite a bit here for an extra sexy, villainous look. Blend and go over the brows with brow powder or some red eyeshadow to perfect the lines and set. The red color in the Lovesick Eye Kit works great for this. Next up, brush some vibrant blush across your cheeks and over the bridge of your nose. Blend well. You can extend it under your eyes and across your cheekbones if you like. You can use some of the red eyeshadow from the Lovesick Eye Kit to get a vibrant pink shade. I'm blending it with a little pink blush for the perfect cartoony pop of color. Now prep your eyes with white eyeshadow. I'm using the lightest shade in the 12-piece eyeshadow palette. I like to highlight the corners of my eyes and brow bone, and then pack it all the way across my lid so it acts like a primer, which makes the next colors I use really pop. Next up, use the dark olive green eyeshadow color and begin to create a cat eye shape with the shadow. Work it into a V shape at the outer edge of your eyes. You can keep it like this if you like, or you can amp up the drama and extend the shadow all the way up into your hairline. It is a Halloween look after all, so don't be afraid to go big or go home. Add the teal green shade in the center and blend into the olive shade. Add some of the black shadow at the edge of your eye for depth. Just make sure to blend well. Continue the green shadows underneath your eyes to keep it sultry. Now it's time to create a really thick dramatic cat eye using your black gel liner. I'm using the Lovesick Smooth Criminal Liner here. Keep it smoky by adding the coal eyeliner on your waterline, and if you're comfortable, on the tight line up top too. The coal liner is perfect for this because it glides on soft and there's no pencil sharpened edges that you have to worry about. Now curl your lashes to prep them for mascara and falsies. Coat your freshly curled lashes with Love 6 Thanks for the Lift Mega Mascara on the top and bottom. And don't forget your falsies. I'm using the winged ones that come in the HT eye kit. They're perfect for Ivy. Once you've glued the false lashes down, blend them into your own lashes with one more sweep of mascara. Moving on to your lips, line them first with a deep red shade. Once again, I'm using my trusty Blackheart Lip Pencil in Burgundy. I like to line outside my natural lip line for pinup looks, especially for a character like Poison Ivy with her signature Poison Kiss. If you prefer, you can make your lips green instead of red, 
but my favorite Ivy look features bright red lips. Fill in with a brighter red lip liner, like Blackheart's Vamp Red Shade. Smudge the deep red color with your finger a bit to get rid of any harsh lines. Filling your lips in completely with lip liner helps your lipstick look brighter and gives it long-lasting staying power. Now coat your lips in the Bright Red Matte Lip Cream. If you like, add the darker red lip cream on top to deepen the color. I'm a big fan of mixing lip colors to get your own custom shade. Finally, contour your face with green shadows for a subtle green hue. I like to do this instead of painting my skin green. I think it translates a little more glam this way. I'm contouring my cheekbones, around my jawline, and up to my temples. Blend it well and make sure it's a subtle shading and there are no harsh lines once you're done. And that's it! Add a red wig and your Poison Ivy costume and you're all set to seduce the city. Now that you've turned over a new leaf, no one will be able to resist you. You're no wallflower, so go plant yourself in the middle of the party and show off your new look. Happy Halloween!